Hey, good morning everybody. Working on the ocean again today. That's one of the nice things about working in Maine is a lot of the jobs we work at are right down on the ocean. This guy's got a spot it's way out on a point. He's got ocean like I'd say 75% of the way around where his house is going to be. This, this land has been in the family I guess for years so it's I would imagine it would be pretty sought after if it was for sale. So he's building a new house down here. Now we came down a couple weeks ago and did the lower half. We couldn't get enough concrete that day to do both, otherwise we would have just done both floors. So we're back now just to finish the project up so he can start framing. It's a nice morning. 7 a.m. right now. The earliest we could get Crete down here was 7 a.m. This is about an hour from our shop. Well, maybe a little bit more than an hour, hour and 15 minutes. So, it's a good little drive. Tide is, I'd say the tide is about halfway, either out or coming back in. It's hard to say right now because it's not really moving. But the tide here moves up and down probably, I don't know if you can see the dark spot on the rocks way over there. It's down, I'd say it's down six or eight feet. From where it comes up when it's totally high tide and that's just about halfway so it'll move up and down 12 14 16 feet here in Maine versus down south in Florida where high and low tide barely move at all so we got two full trucks two 11 yarders we, that figures right around 22 yards and that's all we could get with those two trucks is 22 Oh, we're hoping we don't run out. Is it? It's good. There, you pull that over. Okay. Yeah. Huh? A little bit right here. Yeah, just a little bit right there. I'll pull him ahead to do that haunch. We'll get this whole flat part done. Okay, Michael. Good job, Good man. Good man. Got to move that back that way a little bit. Okay, leave it unlocked, please. I'll be on this side. No, that's good.
going to flip that and just get it right from that one for a second. Yep. Just a tear. Here, hi. Alright, you grab that for a second, Luke? Yep. Probably flip it back down and I'll move him. I'm gonna move you right here. We got 22 by 24 right to the edge of the styrofoam and a lot of it's five and a half. I think we're going to be okay. I think we'll be all right. Let's see the other truck this 22 by 24 equals that divided by. If it's six inches, this is 10 yards. We got 11, so I think we're going to be okay. I think we're good, Mike. No worries. No, we, we got a drain. <laughs> we do. It's a crawl space, bud. You don't need to know about your love life. He ain't 40. <laughs> How old's Michelle? Huh? How old's Michelle? 39. Huh? Ask Darren, he knows. Oh, young one. Old Benji. 40. Huh? 40. Pretty good there.
running it. How'd we talk him into that? I know, he didn't want a bow float. Why is it always useful? I tried to get you. You get to do the haunch. Take a little please.
I'll be, can you flip that chute back around for a sec? Yeah, we won't, we won't fill that up because we look a little high up there. Just move him right over here out of the way for a minute. Both floating your job. Is it okay back you up a little bit? That's gonna make a mess. But good. Up. All right, we'll try that. I think we got enough, but excuse yeah. me. Shovelfuls, huh? Lou, couple shovelfuls. You going out with this right here? I think so. I can, I can pass it to Lou. Well, this I'll help you go over the wall. What? Where are you going? I'll just pass it to Luke right there. I'm gonna pass you this real quick too. Both old man's got this coming in here. Yeah. He's diving. Gotcha. I think that's enough, Luke. Hold on, let Eric mag it first. Mag it? Listen, mag it. Still look like you, Darren. Just scrape a little on the ground. Oh, he's gonna he's just gonna mag it. He said he's that good. I learned from the best. <laughs> I was gonna say learn from the best, the hell with the rat. That's right. All right, 8.30 in the morning. Crete was at seven, plus we had to wait for that second truck for about a half hour. 8.30 in the morning. It's supposed to be in the 80s here today, even down on the coast. Usually it doesn't get like crazy hot down here, but it already feels like it's 90. 100% humidity. It's really, really hot already at 8.30 in the morning. So that, we gotta still power trial that, sorry. It'll be, that'll be done by noon though today. It's gonna go fast, especially on the styrofoam. Well, that's going to do it for the poor guys, so we'll just finish both floating that. And tomorrow's Friday. we got a nice little one tomorrow. Again, way down south from a good over an hour away from the shop. 
pumping it over a house just to reach the little thing out back. Wait till you see that one and uh, try to get Eric to finish up both out in here. That's as easy as bull floating down and back, especially when you got that tilt head. You kind of have to have a tilt head on when, you, when you're that far below. When you're that far below grade, otherwise you wouldn't be able to lift the bull float up high enough. All right, we're gonna wash up and get out of here. So we'll see you guys on the next one.